How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys. Today, as always, hope you're all having a fantastic day. Wherever you guys might be, today is a very special episode. Because we are going to be spending our glory. That's right. Every few months, you get rewarded with glory based on how much you played ranked. Uh, both ranked 1v1, ranked 2v2. You also get glory based on how high you placed in ranked season. Uh, so last season I got to diamond, which was I think the 13th or 14th time I've gotten diamond. I don't really remember actually. Let me check. I haven't, I haven't even looked at my new avatar. Where is it? Okay, there you go. Diamond tier 14. Now I did miss getting diamond one season a long time ago. Mostly just because I took a break. So unfortunately, I don't have the highest that is possible. The highest that you can get possible is tier 15. If you got diamond every single season since the beginning of Brahala rank. So pretty cool. Pretty cool. Uh, I actually think I'm just going to stick to the uh, pot of gold here. <laughs> but I will spend all my glory. So as you guys saw, I have... 11,000 glory now I like to save a little bit every season just so I have a little bit uh, left in the bank just in case they come out with a new legend that I really want to get Skyforged for you know without waiting for the season to end because usually they do come out with a new legend or two or maybe even three probably one or two each season in the middle of the season so, but anyways, I have come to the conclusion that I am going to buy two Skyforged Legends and one Goldforged. I was going to get just only uh, Skyforged Legends because I do want to get all the Legends to have Skyforged colors, but uh, because I can only buy like three or four Skyforged every season and because they're making one or two new Legends every season, it would literally take me almost forever. Um... And be, mainly because the seasons last so long. They're like two or three months. Uh, so it's going to take me a long time. So I want to at least at least get one Goldforged Legend. And if you didn't know, you have to have Skyforged for that Legend before you can buy Goldforged. Enough talking. Let's go ahead and buy some Skyforged. So you might be wondering, what am I going to do? I actually sat looking at all these different Legends... For quite a long time trying to decide which ones I wanted to buy. I went into... If you want to see what the uh, skins look like, by the way, without buying it. Just go into offline play, go to training. And you can go ahead and look at any legend, any color, any skin. So if you want to see what the Goldforge or Skyforge look like on whatever legend and whatever skins. You can do that for free. Just go into training. So anyways, I did that and I came to the conclusion that I'm going to buy... I'm going to buy Nyx, Skyforge Nyx, because I said I was going to back in my Fashion Holla video. I don't know if you guys saw that, but it was a really cool, uh, fun video. But anyways, I didn't have the Goldforged Nyx, and I said end of this season I'm going to buy at least Skyforged Nyx, and I will get Goldforged Nyx eventually. But we're going to start it out by at least getting Skyforged Nyx. Next... I am going to get Caspian Skyforged. Oh man, I'm hyped for this one. I love Caspian. He's not my main or anything, but I've been playing him quite a bit recently, just trying to get him to level 25. He is level 24 now, so I'm in the final stretch. But anyways, we're going to buy Skyforged Caspian just to kind of reward myself for putting in all the work on him. Uh, maybe eventually we'll get the Goldforged Caspian. Oops, where'd I go? And now, saving the best for last. Which legend do you think I'm going to get Goldforged for? This season, I've decided on Goldforged Ragnar. That's right. I'm going to get Goldforged Ragnar, guys. I am super hyped for this. Oh, man. Ragnar is actually one of my highest uh, level legends. I played him a lot when he first came out. I don't play him too much anymore, but definitely I usually play him at least once every day, but that's usually about it. Usually I'm, I'm playing other legends that I'm trying to level up. 
Speaking of leveling up, let's jump into 1v1. We're going to play all these uh, legends that I just got Gold Forge and Skyforge for. So let's go ahead and start out in the order that I unlock. So let's look at Nyx. Boom. Oh, man. Let's look at all the skins in the uh, brand new Skyforge colors. Now, Nyx Skyforge is pretty cool, especially this one, Spectre Knight. I really like that one. Uh, but definitely the Gold Forge looks a lot better on Nyx. So I think I'm just going to go uh, Spectre Knight. And then I'll go ahead and play a game with uh, Caspian and a game with Ragnar after this. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys are definitely uh, spending your glory. Don't forget, though, if you do forget, it's okay. It saves into your account and it rolls over from season to season. If you don't spend it, it's okay. It'll, it'll just mean that next season you'll have even more in your bank account, but you might as well spend it because... Let's be real, the Skyforged and Goldforged colors are some of the best looking colors in the game. Alright, who are we going against? Dr. Sparky, that's a cool name. <gasps> what? I did a gravity- He disconnected! I just killed myself and he disconnected! Are you for real? That was a terrible start. Alright, that game was absolutely uh, bonkers. We're just gonna go ahead and pretend that one didn't... Uh, that one didn't happen, okay? Let's, <laughs> let's try uh, Skyforge Dix again. Ouch, Ulgrim. Oh my goodness. When you're getting beat by the bots, like, before you even go into the match, kind of makes you a little nervous. <laughs> All right, let's go. Going against uh, Zul, no problem. Sea Spirit, Diamond Zul, that's a lot of strength. All right, let's go. The thing with the uh, cannon people that are actually good with cannon is they love to do ground pound off the edge, like... The same amount that I love to do the uh, neutral sig on the blasters, you know what I mean? Death Trap. That one. They like to, uh, they like to do the gauntlet. I mean, I mean the cannon ground pound. There it is, boys! We've taken the lead! And it, it always comes down to, like, whose attack is coming out first? The blaster ne neutral sig? Or the cannon down, ground pound? I don't like using Nick's blaster side sig a whole lot though. Boom, GG, no. I like to do those uh, little hops back and forth too, but it, you gotta be careful because it can be really predictable. GG dude, GG. I actually thought he could have got back if he did his axe neutral sig, but maybe not. 
All right, so if we can beat a Diamond Zul with Nyx, I guess I'm not that terrible, but it, it doesn't feel like I'm very good with uh, Nyx. So let's keep it going, baby. Who's our next contestant? We're talking about Skyforge Caspian. Look how beautiful that looks. All right, so maybe some of these skins don't look that beautiful with Skyforged, but some of them do. This one definitely does. I'm gonna go ahead and use Plague Knight because it just looks so cool. I'll just use default stance. Man, look how dark it is. That's like darker than the black. For real, I think, I don't even know what black uh, Plague Knight looks like on this skin. Does he have a red uh, mask or what? Or is it just black? I'd have to check in training, I guess. But dude, that is a really dark blue. It's so dark blue, I don't even know what to call that. Midnight blue? All right, going against Jacques, the uh, Black Lord Vrax. <laughs> yeah, let's just jump right into that. Oh my gosh, going from Gauntlets to Scythe is so weird. Or if we mean from Scythe, Scythe to Gauntlets, they're so different. What? This dude won't die. There he goes. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Three six in a row. That means he's getting lazy. Oh, okay. Never mind. Cider is okay. The thing is, most players are always looking for the reaction to their movements, so if you don't react, sometimes it just really throws them off. Uh-oh, getting a little bit of lag. Down the death pit you go. Alright, enough with the gauntlets. Let's try a little bit of guitars. That was clean. Oh my gosh, I survived. Bye bye. GG, dude, GG. Caspian Skyforge looking beautiful. All right, guys, we saved the best for last. At long last, we finally have Goldforged Ragnar. The question is, which Ragnar skin should I use on our debut game? I kind of feel like uh, I got to go with Ashen Ragnar or Dark Depths because those are my two favorites. Those are the ones I use the most. Um, Dark Depths is probably a little more popular, so maybe I'll just go with Ashen Ragnar. I really love how gold he is on this one. He is just full of gold. Haven't played Ragnar in a while. I'm a little rusty, but I don't care. He's got Axe and, and uh, Katars. Both are amazing. No excuses. Axe of Katars, amazing. Ragnar, amazingly balanced stats. Look at that. And amazing Sigs. He's just a good legend. If you're not sure who to play, play Ragnar. He's really, really good. 
I'm gonna let him get that weapon. your head up there boy you're gonna get the flame axe on your head all right we did pretty good with the axe let's try the guitars a weapon boom don't need it just punch oh all right at least i punched him in the face once <laughs> kind of go down swinging he's feeling the orb man i don't blame him thor orb good call but honestly i've been doing pretty decent just unarmed oh my goodness that attack killed him again this time from the back like it went he went through it and it still killed him Goodness, that was a home run. What? Okay, man, he has evened it up with some very good play. AKA Orb Spam. But it's all right. Anything works. Like, anything goes, rather. Oh, I'm surprised he didn't do his uh, infamous down air right there. I've been saving my neutral sig all game for Axe. And the down sig, but we don't talk about that. Oh my goodness, that lightning got me again when I'm doing a side sink. <gasps> oh, I'm still alive, dude. You got to do better than that, Thor. Hit me with your best shot. Oh. <laughs> F's in the chat, boys. F's in the chat. Oh my gosh, Thor is a beast. Woo. Maybe I'm a little more rusty with Ragnar than I thought. All right, well, that was really fun, man. I, I gotta admit, I'm very pleased with the Skyforge Nyx. It looks so good. I can't wait to get Goldforge Nyx. And then the Skyforge uh, Caspian. That's right, I wanna see what the, uh, what does the Goldforge Caspian, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's got like a bluish, more, more of a bluish beak going on. And then when we do finally get the uh, Goldforge Nyx, oh man. Oh, man. So good. And then, uh, yeah, Ragnar's capped out, man. I got every single color in the game for Ragnar already. He is done. Maybe not Maybe not white, but I'll get there. I'll get white eventually. White just doesn't look that good in this game. There's no accent color. I don't want white and gray. Give me white and blue, white and yellow, white and anything. Like, look at black. Imagine if it was just black and gray. It would not be nearly as cool as the black and red. Please, BMG, fix white skins. They don't look good in this in this game. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like. It really helps me out. And uh, yeah, be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content and live streams. I hope to see you in the future. This is Lucian Sword. Take it easy, guys.